Okay, I'm going to open this door. I'm pretty sure that there isn't another door on the other side of it. I will not need to search for a bigger key. I don't know what's on the other side of this door, but it will be good to know. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're going now. We're going now. Okay, it worked. Let's, uh, let's go. Well, it's not unlocking any deep memories yet, but it's a long way to the bottom. Oh, here's something. That wall. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that wall, but looking at it, it seems kind of universal. Like, it's just a thing that everyone would know about. But I don't think that's true. All right, yeah, B buried memories, there we are. Well, you look familiar. You look a lot like Jimmy. Well, maybe I can figure out what your deal was as I keep going. And his too. Still can't see the bottom, so I think I have a long way to go yet. Why would you even put in a hole this deep? Me? Were they trying to keep me out? I don't think I'm this big of a menace. Well, if there are corpses down here, that must be what's attracting these crawly guys. They must be carrying animals. But how'd they even get down here? I mean, I don't think they were sealed in. I don't think they lived that long. Oh, here we are. Oh. Yeah, uh, this... This is the bottom. Huh? What is... Hello? Hello? Are you... I, I, I don't like this. I, I, um, I, I don't like this. Hup. 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 Oh! Ah, I screwed that one up, but that's okay. You know, I'm actually not scared of these. I feel like I should be, because they're kind of scary, but like, I don't know, it just, it feels really good to avoid them. I could, I could do this for hours. I, I don't know, it's just fun. Yeah, definitely not getting the same visceral pleasure from avoiding the ghosts. I, I don't like to be around them, but uh, that's that mystery solved. It's just a weird thing with the tentacles, I guess. Oh, actually, I can dodge a lot of them at once. Hold on. All right, let's heal up just to be safe. Okay. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh. Yeah, if I want to get past the lake, I gotta do it the right way. I'll go turn on the light in the lighthouse. Wait, hold on. I am gonna second guess myself here. It seems super obvious that turning on the light will let me pass, but like, how? I I'm just gonna take it for granted for right now. Y yeah, see? Turn on the light in the lighthouse and the monsters go away. Everyone knows that. Oh. Oh, I know this guy. Th this guy's the reason that I can read, and also, like, talk and stuff. He's the big guy! The big guy taught us a lot of stuff. He always called me his most annoying student. But he was friendly when he said it, I think. Yeah, definitely. He was super friendly about it. And now he's dead. Everything down here is dead. I'm trying my hardest not to be disappointed. Because this is everything. This is everything that I've been looking for. This is everything I wanted to find, and it's just nothing. And I don't want to be disappointed, but I am, and I'm just, I'm so angry about that. And I don't know why. Because everything else is like this, why would this be any different? I, the world didn't lie to me about this, so why did I lie to myself? Maybe I was looking for closure, but the more I remember, the more it feels like I'm just gonna go back up and be the same person in the same place. Well, big guy, looks like you have one last gift for me. Maybe that'll cure my ills. Well... 
It'll definitely come in handy. Looks like I should probably start heading back up. Hello there again, Big Wall. I know you make me feel like I need to hurry to get up there, but I'm sorry to say there's nothing I'm in a hurry to get up to. Why do I feel like I need to hurry? I mean, I didn't leave anything up there, right? I, there's no reason for me to hurry. I was already up there. I'm pretty sure there's nothing new to see. There's no re there's no reason to rush. I don't even why why do I even need to get up there, right? Like like Al? Like who what what even is Al doing up there? He might be. He he's definitely he definitely went up before I did. Al? Al, is that your name? Hey Al? Whew. Oh boy. Hey Al, what you doing? I'm summoned. I'm chosen. I need to go now with the king. Oh, cool. Are you going to be back in time for your turn at the Blackwater Dodge tourney? Because, I mean, we can reschedule if we need to. I don't think you'll need to. Oh, come on. You're like second best. At come, my Hollow Knight. No more need to trouble yourself with these failures. That one especially. It might be the most disappointing of all. Shoot, really? I was almost expecting it to be me. It was never going to be you. What? Our existence is to hold the radiance inside of us. We were made for the Black Egg, and you devoted your life to nothing. Nothing except for the games you arrange or the silly names you've given all of us. Uh, those are fun! You love those! They're a waste of time. No, you told me you love them. I mean, I asked you if you were happy playing them, and you said yes! And, I mean, if you need to get rid of that to do the Radiance thing, do you really want to? Listen. I mean, you could just come down here and we could do the tournament instead. Who cares? I mean, what's that guy gonna do? Charlie, listen. Ah, see? You clearly don't hate the names that much. Come on, who needs this? Listen. This is the most important thing there is. It outweighs your wants. It outweighs mine. This is my purpose, and I will live up to it. <sighs> okay, fine. Is I... that Dad up there? Yeah, looks like. Tell him I love him. Jimmy wants you to tell Dad he loves him. I guess I can do that. Goodbye. Wait, do something for me too. Yes? Just don't forget about me, okay? Just, just don't forget- Hey there. So, what did you find down the hole? I think I found who I am. Oh? And what's that? A disappointment. Oh. Who did you disappoint? My father. Oh, the Pale King? Well, I mean, honestly, it, it could be worse. I mean, if he was my dad, I would just like... Make it my life's goal to disappoint him. Sure, but I was the jar. I was the jar that was supposed to hold the radiance inside me, and I didn't make the cut, just like all these other guys. And the guy who did make the cut did a great job. Oh, my life hasn't sucked the entire time because, you know, the plan was deeply flawed from the outset. Sure, but what if I could have done it better? What if I just, you know, made it my goal to do it and then did it? Then maybe it wouldn't have. I mean... That's a fun, super stretchy hypothetical to mull over, but it's not what happened, so who cares? I mean, no one blames you for not doing it. But that's what I was made for. And is that all you are? Maybe? I don't know. I, I, I don't know what to do with any of this. I don't even know if this is anything. I mean, I was down there super disappointed I didn't get like a life-changing revelation, and then I just got it, and I don't feel any different than I did down there. I'm just... Just still everything I already was. No one knows what to do with their past, dude. Like, if this was a book, you were thinking this was the climax, right? Like, here's this, the end, but you're living a life. There was never a guarantee that your big reveal was going to be world-shattering. It might just be kind of depressing. And that's something that you can end a book with just fine, but you don't get the end. It's just... Your life keeps going. So we go one day at a time, or we try to build it up to something, or we just do whatever we want while we're still kicking around. That's... that's life. I mean, that's all of our lives. Yeah, I guess, but why is it like that? If that's the ultimate truth or whatever, then why do I feel bad about it? I don't know. That's the big mystery. We're just little pieces of a big hive 
thinking that we're the queen, even though it doesn't do us any fucking good to think that. I'd say it works out for some, but honestly, I might as well just not say that for how rare it is. And it all leads to disappointment at best, and at worst, it destroys our lives. And I think the people that are happy are happy that they found a way to be part of the hive. Or maybe they just found a way to be who they are now and not who they think they might be. I, I don't know. I haven't fucking found the answer to that question myself, but if you mean what to do immediately, then probably the next thing to do is go see Grandma. These are the kind of things that, you know, it's good to talk through with her. Maybe it's worth a shot at least. Actually. Isn't it super what sad that, that your only friends you've just given? Vessel? That's oh, good advice. Maybe you should meet everyone outside of Hollow. But that would require a leave. Do you remind her that you're fighting you have the social skills of a destroyer? You've never been sent. You're incapable of that level of creativity. Oh, you've hardly done any combat training today. You need to use that to keep your combat skills up because if they go away, it'll be proven once for all that you're a completely useless person. What the hell? Huh? You you okay? Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm fine. Are, are you? Yeah, I'm good. Why? Uh, no, no reason. I'm, I'm gonna head out. Okay. Oh, do you mind if I actually hang out here for a bit? I have never been down here, and all these platforms look really good for practicing needle lining in dangerous areas. Yeah, that's fine, but, uh... You're really good at fighting? You probably don't need to do that much training. Eh, it gives me something to do. Uh, okay. I'll, uh, see you later then. Okay, see ya. Well, I did it. I guess I made it to the bottom. The end.